What is up guys and welcome back to JDOT Play. Today we are at the Slayton Farm School in Pennsylvania. Apparently this started as like a juvenile refugee. It was to avoid juveniles going to penitentiaries or prison. And then it turned into an all girls school I believe and shut down in 2001. It's just been laying here abandoned since then. They had all sorts of plans for it. The, they did get approval to make it historic, but it just never went through. So now we just have all this land and there's apparently seven buildings still standing. So let's see what this place has to offer. All right, so we're starting at the back of the complex here. And I think this might be like the old church. I'm not really sure. We just passed through the little bit that remains of a basketball court. But this place is awesome. Like, look at that. There's just so much still here. This place is completely boarded. And I don't think this is the church. There's no real way into this building that I see. But I just love this. So yeah, that first building was kind of a bust. It's completely boarded up and not really much of a way in. But there is still so much more to explore here. I mean, we're headed up on some other buildings here and they were all opened, it looked like, and I can't wait to get to the main building. Apparently earlier this year, it did catch fire though. So hopefully there's still some left of it. I can't wait to see this though. Get through here. How's that? Just all sand everywhere? Yeah. Looks like all these buildings, they just like ripped out the inside of the school and sort everything in here. There's like a grill over here and a desk. Let's see. I left my backpack in the car and my backpack has a light in it. Which is desks and everything just ripped out from the school. This is an old sewing table. Some stairs and the beds. This is kind of weird. Some old lockers over here. I wonder if there's anything in them. Somebody drawing Batman. Barely even see in here. There's some old lockers, the old beds from the dorms. The main dorm is the part that built that burned down though. Anything in there? Yeah, it's like an old workshop. <laughs> Let's see. Oh wow. It's just an old workshop from the school. Everything is just left here. I'm probably gonna have to brighten this up until you get it actually editing, but Everything is just still here. All the drawers, like I'm surprised this like hasn't been taken. Oh, it's chilly in here. Oh no. The floor is bending in and collapsed a little bit. There's a mega hole. Yeah, I know. Oh, this, uh, this floor is a bit sketchy, but this workshop just goes on and on. I mean, the main part we want to get to is the old dormitory in the main building, because apparently the dormitory is the one that burned and the main building is still standing. It's up the path a little further, so let's see if we can find that. Oh, 
And obviously somebody else has just propped this door open. This whole place is insane to me though. And finally it's warming up. It was so cold today and I did not bring a jacket. But these are just the old buildings from the school. And like I said, it closed in 2001. They just never finalized the plan of what to do with it. And it's just been sitting here since. It's an old water tower over there. Yeah. I think this school did like everything. It was like a reform school first. Barbershop chair. Like they have workshops, they have barbershop chairs. They just have a little bit of everything here to help. I believe it was to help juveniles like get back on their feet instead of incarcerating them, which is really cool, but it didn't last very long before it just turned into a regular school. All right, now we're coming up on what I really wanted to see. We're coming up on one of the main buildings and it is still, it still looks amazing. I really hope there is a way in here, but this is so cool. Check it out. Everything is just left standing here. Another little basketball court. I wonder what that is over there. There's just so many buildings. There's another one back there in the woods. And like, it looks like another little uh, workshop over there. It amazes me that they can't find anything else to do with this property. I mean, it's a huge property with a lot of the buildings still intact and nothing really too wrong with them. There's another building over there. I'm gonna guess what they meant when they said seven buildings were still standing is seven main buildings because the little ones, that was three. Now we've got three more over here, so I'm not quite sure yet, but the door is open. Oh, wow. It is so dark in here. Hopefully my camera can do it justice with the little bit of natural light that's being let in here. Oh no. Oh wow. Yeah, there's not much further to go. Can you get your phone There we go. Oh, the whole place is, oh wow. No, we can keep going. The whole place is just like caving in on itself, it looks like. I believe this looks like it was a kitchen because that's like a huge hood for like a stove. A pool table just left here. Like, and the building just looks amazing. Like, look at these walls. Holy crap. This might be my new favorite place. And it just keeps going. Thankfully, the floor is concrete. Welcome to hell. Some chairs and stuff left. The whole place is basically gutted though. I guess that's what was in all those sheds out there. It keeps going this way. It's a freaking VHS tape. focus holy shit and the stairs to go up a small little bathroom I wonder if this was a dorm because that bathroom has a bath in it oh my god it just keeps going
the showers. So I guess this was one of the dormitory buildings. And a huge open room with a nice fireplace. How big was this building from the outside? Pretty big. I think we're in the one of the wings. Books. Oh god, it looks like somebody might live in that one. <laughs> Let's try to stay clear of that. Don't want to mess with anybody. Oh yeah. All the desks and shelves and everything are still here. Let's go upstairs. Yeah, let's try it. Also, probably one of the most sketchy places we've gone to. How do we? How do we even get in here? We came out from that way. Oh, a little bit of natural light up here. see it out like this was an amazing property yeah, what's your patch? Uh, two one five three what no oh no, Z no. There's just hallways and hallways of stuff. So much of the school just left behind. Oh, check this out. Little circuit breaker? Circuit something? Probably circuit one. At least there is some more natural light up here. I am just amazed by all of this. The old bathrooms. We had two bathtubs. Look how tiny they are. Oh my God. Everything's just broken in here. Somebody sleeps here? Maybe they got shards all over the bed. Give me your flashlight because you have mine on there. Yeah. I am always so good at forgetting my big light. Oh jeez. Like you can see the mirrors on the wall. Like I know they use them in like penitentiaries to keep people from like hurting themselves with broken glass. Oh, that door just creeped me out that a mirror came through. Look at that, there's like just rooms and drawers and dressers all over the place. So much of the stuff was just left here. God, a mirror. Sorry, bud. We got like a double bed here. What if that sets an awful alarm? It's stuck. Let's not make too much noise. All right, well that's it for this wing. Let's head back the other way. There's a whole nother wing up here. What? What? This is like its own little private one. Maybe. How would they get up here? There's no elevator. Mm. Yeah. Stop here. <laughs> Find your way up the stairs somehow. 
little closet. Another small bathroom. I'm always so scared walking around these corners. I'm just gonna run into somebody. Oh, it's always so terrifying. That is insane out there. But my battery's about to die, so give me one second, guys, and I gotta get that switched out. All right, fresh battery in. Let's hope this one makes it through. You got so much stuff on your back. Ah, good enough. All the mirrors are like painted over in this part. What the dicks? Yeah, that's Pennsylvania for you. Things. These places don't have central air. There's all these radiators like this. And those were to cover it and so people didn't get injured on them. More bedrooms. So this was just an old dorm, I guess. All the paint is just chipping off the walls. Most of the windows are straight shattered. That's it for upstairs. Let's head back down and then we got a couple more buildings to explore here. This might be a long one. At least this is one of the more structurally sound. <laughs> right. This must have been like the head. Yeah, like the admiration. Ooh, that's a cool shot. Oh, that is amazing. Where did we? Stairs right here. These are them, aren't they? Yeah, this is them. <laughs> oh my god, that looks so amazing. Doesn't it? I don't know. Some of the doors are. Oh god, All right, that one's broken. No, no, there's something. Part of a fire alarm. That So here's what the radiators were like. This one doesn't even have them behind it though, so I'm a little bit confused. Oh. Is that stairs to get out? Yeah, it's like a fire escape. Oh, and this one's actually open. This has been what? Hurry? Huh? Look. Oh, a little bit. But that leads the fire escape down the side. Alright, hmm. here's either get in front of me or get behind me. Alright, I'll set all this down. Oh god, this is not stable. It's definitely been burned. Like, this is quite the nice fire escape, though. This is how dark this place is without any lights. I really should have brought my big light, but that might be it for this building. Oh, that's where we started over there. That's where we came in. No. Yeah, because that's where I walked up. That's definitely where we came in. I oh, don't. Wait. That is where we came in, dude. Oh, it's like a U shape. I thought it was L shape. Is this a different part of the building? I'm so confused on where we are now. Oh God, we're lost in the building. This way? No, no, other way. This way, that's right. No, that way. This way, all right. At least okay. the mirror's got this. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, this looks right. Yeah, because there's the VHS tape. Oh, yes. Oh, no. Uh, oh, no. It might be open. Oh, Jesus. Oh, there's your wood. Stay on the center. Why does there always have to be a freaking basement? Always a basement. Wouldn't be a proper creepy place for the basement. This is the toilet smash down here. Oh, record. Oh wow. We almost missed this. Oh they have arcade cabinets. Huh? They have arcade cabinets. Oh my god. Alright, this is when 
to the top of the list for places we've gone to. These are all, all our old arcade cabinets. Just destroyed, which is kind of sad. Can you see any game names on them? No, I was trying to look. That one looks like a sports game. Yeah. More arcade cabinets. Holy Top crap. Speed. Never heard of oh. it. Watch out for nails and stuff, dude. An old TV. This building is huge. What the heck is this? Dude, I found a rave, rave room. A rave room. Rave. <laughs> it's all glow sticks. Oh, that's fucking recent, I'll tell you what. Some, I mean, somebody probably came in here to do a picture in here. That is awesome. Yeah, it sucks. They left a very nice spectrum. Right, but none of it like glows anymore. Like, look at this. That is crazy. Let's head back out to the main part. Yeah, Everybody wants to be a cat. <laughs> yeah, it is true. I think this is actually ground. Because on the outside, it looked like it was three stories. Did it? Yeah. I feel like these windows, I don't know. I don't think it goes anywhere. Like all the pool tables are just left here. Pac-Man. Miss Pac-Man. There's an old Pac-Man machine. Oh no, baby Pac-Man. I didn't. I wasn't aware that was a thing. Neither was I. A little foosball table. I mean, they really just moved out once it closed and left everything behind. Right? What are these? These little independent timeout rooms? Puts the lotion on and skin or else it gets the hole again. Oh my god, it keeps going this way too. Spooky, scary skeleton. <laughs> what is this? It's like a boiler room. Looks like there used to be more cabinets on these ledges over here. That is ridiculous. Another 
set of stairs. Going up or down? Up. Oh, damn. <laughs> Another sub basement would be awesome. That would be fucking extra. Ow, motherfucker. Anything in there? Uh, this must have been the electrical room. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Holy crap. All the old electrical equipment for the buildings just down here. Look at all the breakers. These old school hammer breakers. Dude, this one is a transformer. Three phase. 20 bucks if you lick it. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> Probably get tetanus before I get fucking anything else. You haven't had your tetanus shot? I think I'm up to date. Oh, this is the other room we were just in. Look at this, phone line. Oh, wow. Phone jack. I guess we would take these stairs up. We can try. Oh, these are worse than the other ones. Oh my god. Oh, I've never seen them flex. Huh? So I've not really seen them flex underneath the piece. Yeah. So that's oh shit, we're back at the start. Are we? Yeah. Did we walk right past this? I guess. Hey, we're. <laughs> I mean, we almost missed the first set of stairs. Right? I guess that's it for this building. There are still so many more to go though, so I don't even know. Like this video is probably already long enough. So I'm gonna end this one here and we're gonna do a part two here because this place just has so much to offer. So thank you guys for watching this. Make sure you come back in probably two weeks for part two. Get some merch if you haven't already. It's comfy, it's cheap, it's like 14 bucks. There's new stuff up, I don't even have it yet. Thank you guys as always and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.